Okay, we're back to finish up um, Shot Goodwill box number 57. And again, if you see anything in, in the box that you want under this video, leave a comment under the comment section with a timestamp, a description, and the price. Um, my Gmail address is myscowitch2 at gmail.com. You need to send me your information in order to comment. I need a PayPal email if you have one, your shipping address, your YouTube name, and your full name first and last. That's for shipping and co to connect you with the uh, your YouTube name. We ship only in the U.S. and shipping is a flat rate of $5. We invoice at the first of the month or at $100 in sales, whichever occurs first. The only exception to that is when you need it immediately. You just need to email me and tell me that. And um, I'll get you an invoice and once you pay it, we'll ship the item. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> The first thing we have is a bolo tie with cowboy boot, boot and this black enamel is beautiful. Here's the back. It's in very good shape. The leather's in good shape. Your end um, caps there are in good shape. We're going to do this one for 20 The next one we have is this here's the back your end caps are in good shape the leather's in good shape we're doing this one for 10 because it has a little that may come off I just haven't tried to make it come off let's see or that just may be an imperfection I don't know but anyway there's that We have another one, the same thing, but there's no dark spot on the pearl. Well, maybe teeny right there. Or maybe that's just... You got your rhinestones are all there. Here's the back. It's in good shape. Your end caps are in pretty good shape. They have a little wear on them. This one is $10 also. The next item we have is this really pretty necklace. It's got this copper um, design on top. This is a wooden piece. I believe it's wooden. With this done on top. This looks like it's a copper chain. And it goes, just fits over the head. Yes, this is all copper. It's not magnetic. Very cool necklace. I'm going to put it on Big Sky here. Just so you can see it. There you go. That copper necklace is going to be $10. Very pretty. Very beautiful chain on that, too. And then there's the pendant. The next necklace we have. It's got a little fuzz on it. It's got a lobster claw clasp and extender. This is gold tongue Rolo chain. Comes to these little seed beads and brown cream white and blue comes down to this little tassel here with little tassels attached with little stones I believe agates they're, they're kind of creamy colored there's your tassel again this little necklace is five dollars very cute We have a Cleopatra style necklace. Very pretty in the gold tone. Here's the back of it. It's in excellent condition. 
It's got a lobster claw clasp, an extender with the bead. We're going to put it on Sky. You can see how pretty that is. There you go. We're going to do this necklace for $8. I said it's very pretty. It's in excellent condition. Thank you. You're welcome, darling. The next one's a really cool necklace. You've got a hammered pendant with um, some cording there. And then it comes down, and this has got to be unknotted. There we go. There you go. So this fringe here, I call it fringe or tassel, whichever one you want to call it. Some of the gold, it has some silver look to it. You can see that on the camera right there in the center of it. Doesn't take away from the necklace at all. Beautiful. Rollo chain, very long. It's got a lobster claw clasp, an extender with the bead, and that's in silver tone. Let's see how long this necklace is. We have it fully extended. Whoops. And it is, I'd say 31 inches. To here. So like I said, it's very pretty. Oh, well, let's put it on Big Sky, too, so you can see it. Let me take it up some. Oh, that's pretty. Very pretty. There you go. That necklace is going to be $8. The next one is a vintage necklace. Beautiful. I wonder if we have any earrings that match. Anyway, don't worry about it if you can't see anything on top, honey. Yeah, this is very pretty. All the rhinestones are there. So you can see. There we go. Let me unhook it again. I love these vintage necklaces, rhinestone necklaces. Let's see how long that one is. Say 15 and a quarter or 15 and a half. This one is marked. Ooh, it's a Weiss. Oh, shoot. Yes, that's really nice. It's a who? Weiss. Okay. W E I S S. Hmm, we're going to do this one for 20. Beautiful. Okay, the next one we have is a silver tone necklace with charms. It's a long necklace. And it has an extender and a lobster claw. It's got a pretty Rolo chain and silver tone. And here are your charms. They're mostly in acrylic beads. And little keys and a little flower. And some circles. Very cute. This is $5. And it's fairly long. Let me tell you how long it is. Without the extender, it is...
32 inches. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Next one we have is gunmetal. And this is a beauty. Beautiful enamel work. Uh, beautiful foil work with acrylic poured over. Here's the back. It's in excellent condition. The chain is a rope chain. Just a second. Okay. Rope chain, extender with a bead. We'll put this on sky. It's very pretty. And we're going to do that one for six dollars. There, that was kind of that one. The next one we have is gold tone chain, uh, double lobster claws, uh, nice curved chain on this, beautiful little blue, these are glass, blue glass and coral colored beads has a southwestern look with this fringe it's very pretty this is five dollars you get double lobster claws and there you go very pretty the next is pearl crystal or maybe not no that's acrylic faux pearl um, rhinestone rondelles in there some more acrylic and blue and clear these are glass crystals lobster claw clasp very pretty let's see how long this one is they're like this. I just like to measure them out, lay out. Sixteen inches. And we'll do this one for five dollars. Very pretty. Okay, the next one is a gold tone, but it's matte gold tone. You've got a pretty lobster claw clasp and extender with a bead, and here is a tag. We think it's a tag. It just may be a yeah premier design. If I can get it to where I can show it. Premier Design, beautiful links, matte gold tone look, I'm going to put it on Big Sky, so you can see how pretty that is on, we're doing that necklace for $8, and it is without the extender all the way, so you have an inch left on the extender. So whatever I tell you, you can add an inch. It is 28. 28 inches. So it's 29 with the extender. Next is a dainty little pearl necklace. Um, they're not knotted in between. They have a beautiful luster on them. Gold tone ring ring class there's a look on sky those are very pretty very lightweight I'm gonna do these for two dollars the next isn't like the nautical or um, Amorite Fossil 
with a starfish with a little rhinestone in the middle. And you know, the starfish has an old dot in the middle. Anyway, when you see it. Then you have... Then you have... Um, these beads, I'm not sure what they're made out of. They're very light. They might be wood. Here. Faux pearl. Blue bead. That's acrylic, I believe. These are glass. Little flowers. More pearls than those beads. These are stone. More stone. Pearl. Just a real pretty little necklace. The color cord the color on this is very pretty. Uh, let's see. Let's put it on the uh, big sky here. So you can get a look at it. I got sniffles. Must be the uh, front coming in or something. I think I have it turned around the wrong way. There we go. Here's your necklace. Very cute. That's five dollars. A long necklace. The necklace is thirty inches. Very cute. Next one is a long necklace also. Measure it first. This necklace is forty two inches without the extension, and the extender is another three inches, so that makes it forty five altogether. Now let's look at it. It's gold tongue, lobster claw clasp, extender with a bead, and it is marked Aldo, A-L-D-O. Nice um, textured Rolo chain. Then you have these glass beads that are fasted and the pearls. I don't know if they're I think they're glass too, I'm not sure. And then you have it again. Love that one, if, the way it's capped. You've got this rhinestone rondelle in between these two. The pearl and the fasted crystal. And here's the bottom of your necklace. This is a really pretty necklace. We're gonna do this one for $8. Beautiful. The next one we have is a long necklace. Here is your extender, your lobster claw clasp. You have a bead on your extender. This one also is premier design. Beautiful stone, but it's not um, turquoise. I believe it's highlight. Very pretty, though. Very well done. You could wear it double also like that. We're going to do this one for $9. Beautiful. Ooh la la. Save it for the minion. <laughs> Look at this. And the tassel. Here's the back. It's in great shape. That is gorgeous on this beautiful gold tone chain. Extender with the bead. There's no maker's thing on this. I'm going to put it on Big Sky because we just have to display that. That is beautiful. <laughs> yes, you got it right that time. There you go. That is beautiful. We're going to do that one for $9. It's gorgeous. Ooh. 
The next one we have is also gold tone. Lobster claw clasp. And it has an extender with little rings you can put it in. It's double chained. Until you get to this part, it becomes single chain, but it has a lot of a drop in here. And there's your little heart. The hands holding the heart. Friendship and love. Some more hammered little hearts. These are cat's eye beads here. And these are some kind of little stone here and here. So you have stone, cat's eye, hammered hearts. Uh, heart, friendship heart, and here's a little cross. Let's put it on Big Sky. I heard the clock. Mm -hmm. This is pretty. I'll quit messing with it. You're mm -hmm. messing it up. go. Very pretty necklace. That one's going to go for $9. Again, you have your tiger's eye. You have other jasper stones in here. Beautiful little charms. Pretty gold tongue chain. The next one is a statement chain, I call it. It's got a large lobster claw clasp, a long extender. It's curved chain, beautiful gold tone. Let's see, let me get it twisted right here. So you can see. It's very pretty. We're going to put it on sky. And you'll see why we call it a statement chain. As I get it on. Okay. Very pretty. That necklace is going to be $5 because there's no maker's mark on that. But it looks high end. Nice weight, beautiful gold. Come. We have a silver tone one with mesh, mesh and gold tone chain. Lobster claw clasp. Extender with the bead. Silver, silver tone and gold tone. Intertwined links. That's beautiful with gray. Very pretty. We're going to do that one for $5. Awesome piece. Next one we have, I think it's a designer one. It's got these triple tassels here. Let me get it untangled. Okay. There's your, no, quadruple tassels. Um, three, we, we've got chains, double length and then a chain running through the double lengths. Extra large lobster claw class. This is a Jessica Simpson. That's her tag. Here's the necklace. Let's go and put it on sky, big sky. And there's your look. This necklace is going to be $8. Very cute. Not sure about this one. Oh, yeah, there's the. It's come off. It needs to be fixed. I'm not going to fix it. It's a very long, beautiful chain be an easy fix you just have to reconnect it here to this and there's your loops 
So I'm going to put this in the Hobby Lot. This beautiful butterfly pendant. Pendant. Pen. Brooch. I don't see any marks on it. It's absolutely beautiful. It's got purple and cranberry colored and pink and light periwinkle blue or either lavender um, rhinestones in it fairly large. Yes, it's at least two inches going across. We're going to do this one for $6. It's very beautiful. We have a little Avon. It's got kind of, it needs to be cleaned up on the back. This is porcelain. And then they have it nicely glazed here with the flowers. A little heart pendant. I mean, brooch or pen. We're going to do this one for $3. We have this artisan piece. The pen, it's by Lucinda. Woman pens. And this one's shopping. These are very cute and very well done. It's five dollars. Have a little purse pen. And this one's three dollars. Very cute. Next one we have is this little daisy, or either um, sunflower. No, no, echinacea like pen um, flower. That's what it reminds me of, echinacea, because it has this dome on it, and the echinacea flower has that. Silver tone on the back, in excellent condition. This one's five dollars. How do you remember all those things? What? <laughs> With flowers and everything. They're amazing. Well, thank you, honey. Because I love them. <laughs> because my grandmother had lots of flowers in her yard. Beautiful pants here. Just gorgeous. And look, this one's done with the safety pin. It looks like it was on a bracelet because this looks like you could put it on a bracelet and they've got a safety pin there and then we have this one that's got the gunmetal colored back and the beautiful AB rhinestones in the center of both of these these are beautiful even if that is a safety pin and we are going to do these two for ten dollars they are gorgeous Gorgeous. We have this beautiful one here, and it's a marked one. I don't think those were marked. I didn't see any marks. This one is, I think it says Monet. Let's see. Yeah. This is a Monet. Beautiful amber colored, fasted. Um, marquee shaped stones, rhinestones, and then they're surrounded by these other tiny round rhinestones, and they look gold tone in color. And then you have a little rhinestone here in the center. This is beautiful. 
And this one is $8. Beautiful Monet. This next one is a shoe clip. There you go, or fur clip or clip song. Little bow. I'm going to do this one for $3. Oh, wait a minute. It's a Monet with the little rhinestone on it. That's different. I'm going to do this one for $5. It's a sign piece. The next, we're gonna look on the back first. <laughs> Learn my lesson. Oh, I doubt it. <laughs> Here is a uh, gold <laughs> and oval fasted pieces. Very pretty in the purples and red. We're gonna do this one for four dollars. It's beautiful. Oh, I like this one. This is a rainbow snowflake. Looks like to me a snowflake. And since there's no such thing as a rainbow snowflake, as far as I know, it's got a gold tone back. It could also be a flower. So we're gonna do this one for $5. It's in excellent condition. Very pretty. We have this little vintage lily pen. This is old. Very cute. I don't see any names on it. We're going to do this one for $3. Very cute. The next one we have here is not marked either, and it's floral. Pretty leaves, the way that goes through there. Looks like all the rhinestones are there. This one's $5, very pretty. And how many of you are loving the snow right now? <laughs> I hope you are staying warm and keep your fireplace going if you have one. I love snow. I do love snow because I don't get to see it very often. There's the back. This one's $5. Very cute. Very appropriate. I'm going to do some Christmas brooches here. This one is a pendant or a pen Christmas tree, and it's beautiful. And this one's $5. Very pretty. Nice weight to it. The next one is just a pen. A little drummer boy. Toy soldier. Not drummer boy. Toy, toy soldier. He's got his gun. And he's going to be five dollars. Very nice. Yep, it's cute. It's adorable. Be great in a Christmas picture too, if you were doing them with brooches, you know. Mm-hmm. Here's the candles. Very pretty with the red enameling in that. All that's enamel work there. Well done. Here's the back. It's in excellent condition. This one's going to be $5. The next one is a poinsettia. There's the back, and it looks vintage. I'm not sure that it is because it's in excellent condition. The enamel work on that's very pretty. This one is $5. Next, we're going to do are some pendants. Or maybe not. Yep, maybe I am. 
These are, this one's marked Marbella. So that's go pretty on pearls. It is an enhancer. So that goes on pearls. This one, also an enhancer. And it is marked. Hmm, what is it marked? Where's my. Ooh. Well, maybe I can see it in the camera. Uh, I'll be right back. I'm sorry, honey. It's yes. okay. Looks like Roman to me. But I don't know for sure. Found it. <sighs> Good, because I sure need it. Yeah, that one's Roman. So that's a Roman one. This one is also a Roman one. And it's an enhancer. And then here's another Roman one, I bet. Yes. And I had one in a prior video that was red like this. Roman one. Very pretty. So these are beautiful to put on a pearl. And they're going to be $35. Those are just beautiful. And they're all um, signed. Only one was different. It was Marbella, which is even better, I think. Older. Great pieces. Let's see what we have here. This one was a pen, but it's broke, but it's still a broke, I mean a pendant. We have this one, this one, this one, that one, and this one. Now let's go through them. Here's your cameo looking, looking one in a uh, gold tone. And it's like that on both sides, so no matter how it turns, it's going to look nice. I'm looking for any marks. I don't see any. It's magnetic. The next one is this beautiful silver tone with a beautiful round cut stone in it. Rhinestone. It is marked. Roman. The next one is this flower. Beautiful enamels. They're centered rhinestone. The back's in good shape. Then this one with your purple and your light lavender colored rhinestones. It was a pen, but the pen's missing. But you still have your pendant. We're going to put it in the pendant lot. Here's another one with enamel in the greens and blues. Graduating circles. A little elephant one. I believe that's enameling on, the, on that elephant. Yeah, that's enameling. It's not a stone. And he has his trunk up. Or curling upwards anyway. And then we had this one, which is actual um, rose quartz. And this may be silver. I don't know. Let's see. Yeah, it's not magnetic, so let's test it. Oh, yeah. 
one is going to be silver. Let's see. This is where I rubbed it. I hate the way that stuff spits out. Oh yeah, that's silver. Turn blue immediately. I'll bring it up so you can see it. See how blue it is? That's fluorescing. <coughs> With the 18 carat. Bless you, honey. Thank you. Okay, so we have 925 rose quartz. We have a little cameo one. We have this beautiful blue stone, and it was a Roman. We had this one that's a pendant only now. And this one with the enamel, the little elephant, and this. Um, i got to think a minute. When you just pull them out of the bag, it's hard to think. Good night. <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's see. We're going to do these for... Thirty dollars. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Thirty dollars. Oh. Give me the bag back for him, please, huh? Yes. Thank you. The next one we have is a little pendant. I mean, uh, brooch set. Scatter pins. This one's got the dragonfly flying around and then here's some leaves I think you could scatter those though the pink on this one's a little bit more pinker here's the backs this one's got a mark on it I can barely see it put the pen out so we can see it Come on. Oh, it says Taiwan. I think. Let me look at Taiwan. And this one, does it say Taiwan too? Yes, it does. So they're both vintage, and we're going to do these for ten dollars. These two little pins, very cute. We had this little necklace here, and I know I've had the earrings before on other videos. This is porcelain. Beautiful little gold tone chain. Spring ring class. I'm going to put it on Big Sky over here. Or will it? No, it'll do on Little Sky. Yeah. It's nice long up. Pendant. All I have on this one in this box, though, came with one earring. And I'm still going to put that one earring with it. Just in case somebody wants to do something else with that. Make a ring out of it. I don't know. There we go. Very pretty. This one is going to be ten dollars. That's beautiful, that necklace. And let me give you the length on the chain. It is stuck on my finger here. Okay. It is twenty three inches. Beautiful chain. The next necklace we have with earrings. Is this one? Here's the back. It's 
got green rhinestones surrounding it and that's cut into there it's a very unusual it's got a makers oh I can't read that born to something let me see born to Rolo Hola I don't know it looks this looks copperish very copperish let's see if I can get it to focus born to Or, I don't know, born to something. And here's the little earrings. Do you remember what kind of animal I told you it was? Uh-uh. Jackalope. A jackalope? What is a jackalope? It's like a jackrabbit with antlers. Oh, like here's antelope. a jackalope. It's not a real animal, but it's I know. Yeah. Well, that's cute. It's got the matching earrings. Here's the whole set is fifteen dollars. I don't know who makes it. I don't know what this. If this is the maker's tag, it's got a little crown and a heart underneath.